Hi, this is Crystal and Jay again, and um, I had three inbox messages for someone asking me how to do this. Um, they specifically wanted to know, after watching some other videos, how to do side-by-side -side videos. Well, actually, that is just video overlay also, but that's okay. Um, so, make sure you have... This is Corel Video Studio Pro 5. Make sure that you have it open and you are in Edit. Now... What I do, and for my former videos, um, I've explained that you've got two video tracks. One regular, one overlay. You're going to need three for this. So click in. You need to right-click in one of the tracks and go to Track Manager. Overlay Tracks. I already have one. I'm going to need to hit OK. And you can have as many as you want. Okay. So, um, first thing you're going to do is go to dun dun dun, your plain video templates. There we go. Um, I just picked, it doesn't matter, but for fun, we'll pick blue and drag that into your first video track and drag it, make it as long as you want. I'm just going to make it that long. So basically what you have there, make sure you hit back. You're going to play that clip. You just got blue. Whoopee, right? Okay. <clears throat> so, um, say you want two videos side by side. Like someone mentioned they were doing like a weight loss video or something and they wanted like video before or video after at the same time. That's pretty simple. So I'm just going to use random videos I have because it doesn't really matter what the video what the video is of. So you're going to go to File, and you're going to go to um, Insert Media File to Library. Insert Video. Do, do, do. And I might already even have something here. But that's okay. I will just go ahead and go get it. Um. <clears throat> so I'm going to pick... We'll just pick this video. Doesn't matter. Okay, and there it is. So that's the video of me. And I'm going to drag it into the first overlay track. And then there I am. So if you want side-by-side -side video, um, you're going to need to, of course, fit it, you know, dep depending on what you want to do here. And just move it around. Ooh, look how skinny I am. Okay, wait. So I'll just leave it that for now. Anyway, so you want to go to your second overlay track. And let's see. Go find another video. Um, and insert media file into library. Insert video. Blah, blah, same thing. Pick your video <clears throat> and put it into the second overlay track. There it is. Okay. There's the second one. You want to move it. But basically at this point, it's just pretty much just messing with like the sizes and that sort of thing and, and getting it Side by side. And you just got to tweak with it. So and then you hit, make sure you have project. Not clip, go all the way back. Blah blah blah. Hit play. Anyway, that's how that works. <laughs> and if you want, um, you know, if you're standing up, of course, 
you're going to have a little more leeway with what you do this way. I mean, I only, these are only headshots. You understand I can't, you know, I mean, I guess I could. You can if you want to actually use this whole screen. There's just some reasons why I don't do that with Corel Video Studio. Um, and I'll explain that in another video. Anyway, that's, that's pretty much it. And then you just save it and do whatever. And then sometimes in some of these videos, when you have this side by side, oops, like this, whatever, um, you can add, you can add another overlay track, and some people have like a little head of them down there, like, actually talking, whatever, this is really easy, so this is just the same overlay effect as like, when I have eight of me singing or whatever, so I guess that's it, I hope that answers somebody's question, if they wanted, um, a different type of tutorial, or you have any other questions, just let me know, thanks a lot. This was Crystal and J.